Hey guys, welcome to my first review and YouTube video on this YouTube channel. So, today, obviously, I'm going to be doing a review of set number 71754, um, the Lego Ninjago Water Dragon, which came out um, fairly recently, actually. I think it was two days ago, and um, this set has, I think, 737 pieces, and is overall a great set. I mean, the figures are great, you can't comes with four. I know five even, and the build overall is quite good, so that's sort of a summary there. Um, and yeah, I think we're gonna get started. So, okay, so firstly, we have Scuba Zane. Now, oh, God, that's a good focus. Yeah, Scuba Zane, and this minifigure is overall quite good, I think. There's got the new uh, ninja piece here, the new um, uh, hood thing, um, and he comes with like a little gun and a katana. And it's quite detailed to be fair, like the, um, you know, it shows his sort of chest plate there, well, not his chest plate, his chest there, and you know, his, his belt there, and it's got some printing on the back, but you can't exactly see that, so it's kind of pointless, uh, but it's covered up by his water tank. And you've also got his head here that has one face, and then the little thing on the back is like mechanical stuff, I don't know. Um, he's got a very angry expression, you know, for a, for a ninja, but... There you are. I think it's quite detailed overall. He's got a, um, a belt there, and he's got like, I think oh, I forgot what he's called, but yeah, they have them to him. Um, and yeah, it's overall quite a detailed figure. I, I quite like it. It's probably one of my um, favorite sort of ninja outfits out of the um, new animation style. I don't know, you know, the animation style after the Ninja movie. Anyways, secondly, we have. Kalmar. Now this minifigure is probably one of my favourites because it comes with this sort of um, octopus squid thing piece on the thing. And it's got some good printing as well. It's got sort of chains and, you know, it's really good. I think it's a really cool minifigure. I also think Kalmar's a really cool villain as well. Um, you've also got his um, torso here with uh, printing and, you know, his sort of squid body or whatever. Um, and he's got his armour and he's also got some printing on the back, uh, like a seashell kind of thing. And it's all overall quite good. And then you've got the, the um, I can't focus. Come on, camera. There we are. It's got the um, headpiece here, which I think looks a little bit different to the show. But overall, I think it's really good. And it's got some stuff on the back here with his shoulder pads and his trident then we have two mare guards i'm pretty sure they're called um they're both the same just different weapons they've got the pyro viper headpiece but just different color and again you know underwater theme with a shell on the back nothing too special then this is one of my favorites out of the whole set we have nrg nia or niad or whatever it's called um i really like this i think you know, the detail's awesome. It looks nothing like it does in the show, but um, it's still awesome. And it's got sort of like these transparent blue pieces, which I really like. And uh, this bit here, which I also really like. I think it's really cool, the detail. And it's also, is this a new headpiece? I'm pretty sure it's a new headpiece. So that's quite cool as well. I just got one face with the ninja mask. So I really, really, really like that. Now, the set also comes with two sort of two side bills. You've got Zane's little underwater pod thing. You know, it's, it's what it is, just an underwater pod, just an extra build to up the piece count, I guess. Um, yeah, it's nothing special really. It's, you know, what you would expect for a little side build. Then you've also got this sort of um, little Merlopian stand thing um, that holds the uh, water amulet, I think it's called. You know, again, just a build. Uh, I think it's quite cool. It's got these little, uses these little ice cream pieces, I'm pretty sure they are. And it's got two tridents here, and then take this off. This here, the water amulet. So overall, I think it's quite a cool set, a cool little build. You know, again, nothing special, but it's cool and it adds to the set, really. Then, God, I've got to make room for this now. Main dragon, so. I'm pretty sure this is like an elemental dragon thing that Nia conjures up after, you know, becoming one with the sea. It is awesome, I love it. I think it's such a cool build. It's got sort of like, not normal wings, but it's like, 
sort of aquatic wings. I don't know how to describe it, but it's really cool. Um, and you've got the tail here, which, you know, it's a tail. <laughs> it's nothing special. But it's an awesome blue dragon, and I really, really like it. Um, and I'm pretty sure if you push the top bit here, you know, it does that. So <laughs> there's not much playability with it in terms of, like, you know, stuff like that. But it's really cool. Like, I, I really do like the build of it. I think the head looks really good. You know, you can open it up like that, pretend it's shooting out or something. And it's got quite a... Quite a long neck compared to other dragons, I think. I'm not sure, but overall, I really, really like it. Um, it's got loads of sort of details here. It's, it does utilize some stickers, which, you know, like most people, I don't like stickers, but, you know, it makes it look better. And it's overall such a nice build. I really like it. And the, I really like this top piece as well. Really, really cool. And it, it does, again, use the uh, sort of spirally aquatic transparent pieces but there you are so overall i think this build's great it's got a long tail it's like the tail's like one two three four like five six pieces it's quite quite big um if i had to guess how long it is i'd say it's probably about a foot just over a foot in length um but you know i could compare it to like a tie fighter maybe it's sort of decent size um but overall i think it's a really good build and got a great set you know i to be fair i did get um it cheaper than most people because i used some vip points but overall i think this set is oh shit. i think it's a really good set i think the honestly the piece count for the price per piece i think is okay it's you know kind of what you expect for a lego ninjago um but the minifigures are great you get kalmar Two Mario Guards again, Scuba Zane, Scuba Zane and NRG Nia. Um, I really do like this set. Um, I would recommend it a load. Oh god, a piece has come off. I've got to find that now. Um, but yeah, I really do like this set and I would recommend. It's probably one of the best sets of the wave, actually. Um, but if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe if you want to. Um, and you can also... Um, put any recommendations for other reviews you'd like. Um, I've also I also picked up the um, Zane no not Zane's Jay's Cyber Dragon, which was on sale. I thought I might as well pick it up. So if you want me to do a review of that, I will. Um, but yeah, apart from that, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.